President Jacob Zuma's in him get shot and killed. By day he was Mike Mpachika, 27, the farm worker from Tongat. After hours he was also Mike, the Inunga from Malawi. On Monday it was Mike the Inunga who was in such deep trouble that he died because of it. Prembelram, a reaction unit South Africa spokesman, said they were called out to the farm outside Tongat by other employees. It was established that four occupants of a white Chevrolet came and asked for the man by name, he said. Two of the suspects were allegedly dressed in police uniform and two in civilian clothing. A worker said he was in his room when he heard the men shouting that Mike gave them fake money which didn't help them. It looks like Mike knew the men. They demanded their money back. Mike tried to escape but they fired three shots at him, hitting him in the head and twice in the body. He said the suspects fled the scene in their car. I called the reaction unit and reported the incident, he said. They arrived and stabilized Mike before he was rushed to hospital, where he later died. The problem is that Mike was from Malawi. No one knows his family. He worked at the farm and practiced as an Inanga. KZN police spokeswoman Captain Kobal Gwala said a case of murder was being investigated by Tongat cops.